Get it right in the school. And you might get it right when you go outside. I wanted to become a Stonewall School role model because there was nothing like that around when I was a kid and struggling with my sexuality. You can be a part of the fabric of everyday life within schools and out of schools. I think it's, it's a wonderful initiative. This should be part of what they're learning because they are the future of tomorrow. Growing up gay and realising you're not alone is very important and so it's very comforting to those people for someone who's happy to be openly gay and reassure the youngsters that uh, whatever it's like now uh, it's going to get better but they can help it get better. When people talk about being trans, lesbian, or gay, or bisexual, say you learn it in a lesson, it's more sensationalised, and I think it just needs to be normalised. It should just be something that we can talk about. You know, there isn't a stereotype of what an LGBT a person is. You know, we come in all shapes, sizes, and colours, uh, genders. I identify myself as a trans lesbian. So two things I tell the story of my life from uh, very young, how I first felt there was something very different about me. School talks are really crucial for our students because it brings the real world in from outside into the school and allows them to engage with it. And so I think it really allows for them to confront and discuss those issues and, and then hopefully become more inclusive themselves. I think the talk was very inspirational. It gave us a different point of view. We're all human, we're all the same. Sexuality does not define gender, which I already knew, but it really expressed that. And now I have a deep understanding. The more that students see diversity and can celebrate diversity and realise that diversity is a positive thing, the better. You go in there and you stand up and you never know what questions you're going to get, what the response is going to be like. One lad put up his hand and he was just like, you gay then? Have I ever killed anybody? <laughs> <laughs> Have you got a car? Are you gay because you don't like football? was I absolutely sure I was gay because their mum was looking for a date and uh, they thought I'd be really good. Which, I don't like football, but I am gay. I get some really good feedback from the school, some very positive feedback. It makes you feel proud and if you feel proud it brings a smile to your face and if you're smiling then obviously it's fun. I always said if there's one student that takes away something from what I've said, then I've done the right thing by doing what I'm doing. All young people feel bewildered, don't they? Feel they're on their own. And to be told that uh, to be different is perfectly all right. Well, what could be better?